I was initially running Lumion at this benchmark speed for my graphics card, graphics memory, CPU score, and system memory. So I did a little research and was able to bump it up to this uh, benchmark data. So what did I do? So I'm running two Lumion system, one Lumion 8 and a Lumion 10. So let's look at those. Here in Lumion 8, to find the benchmark, you need to go back and under settings, you'll see here that we have our editor quality set to two stars. So if your computer is slow, try not running it at the highest quality. So go medium quality or even low quality. Okay. And then for your editor's resolution, uh, set it to 50% or maybe even 25, depending on the speed of your computer. If you'd like to go to your desktop, right click and if you have a graphics card, you can initially refresh twice and uh, open your graphics card control panel. From here, you'd like to go to the set physics configuration and select the one suited for your graphics card. So I have here a Quadro M1, M1200. So select that. You might have a different uh, physics processor. And then after that, go to your manage 3D setting. Okay, so there's the global setting, but you'd like to go to your program settings. So this allows you to customize per program. So you'd like to select a program to customize. So in this case, this is for my Lumion 8. So you can select that. If it's not here, you can click on the add button and select the program installed in your CPU or computer. Here, these are the settings that I have uh, found to be very uh, useful to speed up my computer or my uh, Lumion uh, anisotrophic filtering set at 16 times or X anti-aliasing FX double A set to on anti-aliasing gamma correction set to on anti-aliasing mode enhance the application setting anti-aliasing setting 64 times some would uh, set it at 8x but since I am able to do it at 64x so I've selected that anti-aliasing transparency set to 8 times buffering code CUDA they're all set at the global setting and then we have here maximum pre-rendered frames set to 4 and then OpenGL rendering GPU set to the Quadro M1200 optimize for compute performance on power management mode optimal power shader cache on threaded optimization on triple buffering on vertical sync use the 3D application setting virtual reality pre-rendered frames for I've actually tested some of the settings and did a benchmark in Lumion 
and I was able to increase some uh, settings. Sometimes it went down, so you might need to play around with some of the settings. So once you have done that, or once you have, if you have changed anything, like for example, let me change this, an apply button will appear here at the bottom. So I'll change it back to four, okay? And then click on the apply button. So it will accept our new settings. Once it has done that, that apply button will disappear. Okay, and then you want to go to the adjust image setting with preview. Click here, use my preferences, preference emphasizing balance. Okay, and these are the reasons for selecting which one. Would you like to have more performance but less quality or more quality but very slow? So balance will be good. Click on apply again. and to a computer speed. Rerun your benchmark and hopefully you get a faster speed. So I, I was able to actually bump up those settings to a higher uh, com computational power processing. So I think this one should give me the same result. Unfortunately, my CPU score is quite low. Lumion 10, you just have to select the proper program and test out the different settings. They should be basically the same. Okay, I simply turned off some of the application that I was running and did a rerun benchmark and got my CPU score high as well. So I'm at a full capacity for my graphics card, graphics memory, and systems memory. So I'll try to find more ways to uh, bump this up if I can, but otherwise this should work well.